What's up, YouTubers? This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. So today, guys, I'm going to do something that I never did before. Uh, I got the Apple Watch LTE version, and uh, it is a device that you can get phone calls, text messages, and all your messages on the watch without a cell phone. So today, I paired up Bluetooth headphones, and I am going to leave my cell phone at home as I go about my workday. Now, right now, I want to kind of show you guys real quick before we get started with this test that my Apple Watch is at 100%. I got LTE. I'm ready to go. Uh, and so we're going to do this experiment to see if I can live without a cell phone and only use the Apple Watch. This is going to be fun. So get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric again with another video. And so I got the Apple Watch here and uh, I'm using it as uh, my primary device of choice for today. So uh, let me go ahead and show you guys my Apple Watch and uh, let y'all guys see the time real quick. So let's check this out. So the time is uh, 10.53, I'm at 100% battery life. Uh, and again, I'm only using the Apple Watch and my Bluetooth headphones. So let's roll. So I'm at Starbucks and I ran into my first problem. Um, and uh, I got the, the LG uh, Bluetooth headphones connected to my Apple Watch. And I just received a phone call. Uh, the watch rang, but I was unable to talk via the Bluetooth headset. Uh, so I got to play around with it. It came out to uh, the watch speaker instead of the uh, headphones. So I'm running into one small problem already. I'm not sure whether or not I need the Apple AirPods uh, or these LGs is not compatible with the Apple Watch. But right now I'm having that problem using uh, my headphones making phone calls. Let me play around with it as I get my coffee. I just pulled up uh, in uh, Starbucks. So let's see if I could uh, find out more information about this. And I'm gonna use my Apple Pay. So I'm excited. I got my currency on my Apple Watch. I can use Apple Pay and Starbucks. So I ran into my first snag, but uh, let's see what it's all about. I got my coffee using my Apple Watch, all right? But I, I ran into some more problems because uh, I have gotten a phone call and uh, I got to play around with this so I can get this Bluetooth headphone to work. All right, guys, so I did get the phone to work with the headphones. Uh, I don't know what happened. I received a second phone call uh, and it didn't work, uh, but I played around with it and I just made a phone call and it worked. So um, trying to see here. So my headphones right now is working uh, with the Apple Watch. Uh, I got a few stops I need to make before I go to the office. Uh, uh, the Apple Pay worked very good at, at Starbucks. So uh, we're about to roll and go to our next venture. All right, so uh, I am at the office now and uh, kind of giving you guys an update. It is uh, 1252 and I'm going to kind of let y'all guys see some of the battery life that I'm having right now, which is 87%. I started this vlog out at about uh, 10 a.m. this morning. And uh, I've been doing phone calls, text messages, and kind of listening to a little music. Uh, so looking at the battery life and now I'm at the office. Uh, so I kind of give you guys an update on uh, using the, the Apple Watch as my only device for today. All right, guys. So right now it's about 4 45 p.m. and I've been using the Apple Watch uh, just a standalone device and some of the things that I want to kind of tell you guys that uh, I'm getting a ton of emails a lot of work that I'm getting done and the Apple Watch is, is trying to stay caught up as far as my notifications and stuff like that one thing that I could tell you is that I'm getting a ton of phone calls uh, uh, from the Apple Watch and I'm going to show you guys uh, my battery percentage right now so you can see what the battery is with this device. 
all right guys so uh, as you can see it's 447 and uh, i am getting plagued with a lot of notifications i mean my notifications are going off all day and now uh, but let's see right now we have 66 percent battery life uh, and I can tell you that it's being a workhorse right now with multiple phone calls and multiple emails. And I've been uh, directing traffic uh, between my emails and all my notifications that's going on with this device. So let's go to continue on. I'm still at the business and I'm working hard trying to get some work done and all the notifications coming in. And as you can see, I just got another one. <laughs> Shout out to Kevin. I just got a notification. So there it is. All right, everybody. So uh, the work day is over and I've been using the Apple Watch all day at 6.55. I've been getting blasted with notifications and emails. Kind of kind of difficult to respond to some of the emails using the watch. Uh, but uh, that's one of the Achilles heels. Obviously, you can respond. Um, and uh, it's been kind of taking some of my, my steps. Woo! Nice look, good day today. Look at that. So I've been pretty good with exercising. Kind of going back and forth, uh, walking around the business all day. So I did 5,500 steps today. Back and forth, two miles. Wow, so that has been a pretty good day. But the day ain't over with yet. All right, so the day is not over with yet. But it's kind of showing y'all guys some of my activities that I've been doing all day. Now, again, I started the video about 10 a.m. this morning. It's about 7 p.m. tonight. And 55% uh, battery life just only using uh, this device. It's been okay. Some phone calls, a lot of emails, a lot of text messages. Uh, it's been okay uh, for the most part using the Apple Watch only. But I do see the sense uh, in having a cell phone, believe it or not. But again, the day ain't over with. All right, I'm shutting down the, the store and everything. But the day is not over with. And uh, I am about to uh, go to some nightlife. All right, guys. So uh, I am about to enjoy the nightlife of New Orleans. And it's about 8-11 right now. <laughs> I'm about to go... Uh, Get me a little party on, and I got only the Apple Watch. All right, so I'm out in the bar and having a few coins at the adult beverage place, and I'm at 47%. Let's see where I'm at right now. 8.21, look at that, 8.21, 47% been going all day. Okay guys, so my day is over. Right now it's about 10.35 p.m. I started uh, this the test at about 10 a.m. this morning. I went to multiple stops, including the coffee house and other stops. Uh, so I only used the Apple Watch today along with my Bluetooth headphones. I had some technical difficulties this morning, but the, my Bluetooth headphones synced up with the Apple Watch. I was able to listen to music, also get a lot of work done. Now, uh, a lot of things that I could tell you that uh, the Apple Watch can do, you can get a lot of notifications. You can get your emails, you can get your text messages, you can listen to music, uh, you can respond back kind of briefly to your text messages, to some of your emails. Some of the things that I ran into is that I have so many email accounts that the Apple Watch just cannot keep up with a work day of my caliber. Now, for the average consumer that doesn't have six and seven email accounts, uh, it can work just great. But for me, uh, at my business, I was getting emails upon emails upon emails all day. So overall, can it be done? Yes. But let me switch the camera over and show you guys some stats uh, with the Apple Watch real quick. All right, so uh, right now it's 1039. Uh, I started with the Apple Watch at about 10 a.m. And let me show you some stats. Uh, battery life, and let me put my code in. All right, and after I put my code in, let's uh, go ahead on and, and see, I'm still getting activity stuff here. All right, so let me go here. All right, so I started out at 100%. Uh, right now, I'm at 31%. My battery life using LTE, getting all my notifications and everything. So technically, you can get through the next day, uh, start off the next day, maybe midday uh, with the Apple Watch uh, at 31%. So the battery life is pretty good. And right now, I'm over 12 hours. Uh, using LTE and getting everything just using this for uh, all my work purposes as far as emails, making phone calls, listen to music. Overall, I'm impressed, very impressed with the Apple Watch. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Woo, let me know what you think. 
about this vlog video that I did with the Apple Watch. See you guys on the next video. Peace.